Hey everyone, so I really debated making this video and um, I don't know, I was debating with myself like what I was going to say. This hair is just bugging me. Um, so I'm, I don't know, I'm kind of nervous making this video. I don't exactly know what to say or really how to say it. Um, I've been gone for like on and off and I make a video and I'm like, oh, I'm coming back. And um, the thing is when I say it, I really do mean it. It's just then obstacles get in the way and another thing gets in the way and I'm like, hey, I want to make videos again. And then another thing gets in the way and then it's just like I'm here and I want I really do want to make videos again and I have the time but there's an obstacle and um, it's like it's really difficult and I keep saying that I want to come back and I'm going to come back and I'm going to start making more videos but then I don't because there's just something that gets in the way and I really do want to message the people and get a hold of the people that I talked to like months ago that I you know I just love talking to and I stopped because I stopped making videos and I stopped um, talking to people and you know I really do miss that and now I have the time and now I'm at the point where I'm bored with my life like I need to do something fun and I need to do something interesting and I need to do something that I love and I feel like I haven't been able to do that and I really want to do that I really want to get back into making videos and I kind of thought to myself, maybe I really don't want to do this. Maybe this isn't something I really want to do, but it is. And the only reason I say maybe it's not is because, I don't know, I feel like no one's really going to watch anymore because no one's really seen me, um, you know, making videos. So, I don't know. I've been watching a few videos here and there, but I just kind of stopped reading altogether. Um, and I just recently got back into reading. I finished a book in a day, which is something I have not done in months, which is really amazing. And it was a library book, even. I never read library books. Um, but it was a really good book. And so I'm back into reading, and I want to get back into making videos. And it will be very difficult, but I really want to do it. It'll be, it'll be difficult to start talking to people again, but I'm going to. I'm going to try my hardest. And, um... There is something that could get in the way, but you know what? I'm gonna try to work around it. I won't know. I won't know if I'm making regular videos. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that, but I'm going to certainly try, and I'm going to try to get a hold of people and talk to people that I haven't talked to in a really long time. So I really want to do that, um, and I'm so sorry to the people that I did talk to and then I'm just and then I just suddenly went away and I stopped talking and I please don't take it personally please don't I mean you have every right to be upset if you are but I am so sorry I just things got in the way and I just I wasn't able to make videos and I wasn't even able to get a hold of people um so let me just quickly explain why um I was at my dad's most of the summer and he lives in Canada and basically all I have is an iPad and I can't message people on the iPad I can make videos and I can upload them but you see you really don't have a whole lot of privacy in that house and it's kinda weird if you sit down and you start talking to your iPad while your dad's trying to watch TV that's a little awkward um, so half of the summer, I didn't even have Wi-Fi, so I wasn't even able to use the iPad anyway. And then the other half of the summer, I just, I don't know, I wasn't reading, so like, what is there to make a video on? And I just didn't, like, I was basically watching a whole bunch of Netflix. I got caught up in Netflix, and I wasn't reading, so there was really nothing to make a video on. That's that. But anyway, as I was saying, I use an iPad, and I can't message people on the iPad. So, that was kind of tricky. Um, that was an obstacle that kind of got in my way. 
but um, now I'm going to try to get a hold of people. It may be a week, it may be two weeks, I don't know, because I don't even have Wi-Fi here. So I've been going to the library to use the Wi-Fi, and if I get a chance when I'm at the library, I will try to message people. I will try to say hey and something. I don't know. I feel like really bad. So I feel really bad. I do. Honestly, honestly, I feel bad. And just, I feel like really bad. I do. <laughs> Um, so I'm going to try within the week, or, within a week or two to message some people. So, um, with that said, I'm very sorry, and I want to make videos again, and I want to, I don't know, start talking again, and so, I don't know, I'll just talk about the books, or, I read two books in like a month, but I'll talk about the books that I just recently read. So, first off... First of, first off, I read um, *The Future of Us* by J. Asher and I don't remember the other author, but that was such a good book. I loved it. It was so cute. Um, I didn't love it as much as *13 Reasons Why*, but I did really enjoy it. And I read the first book to this. Um, this is the *Homelander*, the *Homelander* series or whatever. This is book two. I read book one and I just started book two so it's this I am really 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 enjoying these books um they're just so like they're just so interesting and they're they're gripping I love this book so I'm reading this book um I love the series it's just it's amazing um basically it's about this kid who wakes up in this like torture room and his death is ordered and he has to figure out how he's gonna get out and it's just so much more than that and it's amazing um so I'm current so I read the first book to this and I'm currently reading the second book I'm also reading I'll Be There by Holly Goldberg Sloan oh I forgot to tell you the author see I am I am rusty guys um this is by Andrew Clavin Clavin. Clavin. And I'm reading I'll Be There by Holly Goldberg Sloan. I'm not that far in, as you can see. Hold on. I'm not that far in. I just started reading like yesterday. I'm on page 32. But I am really enjoying this actually. It's pretty good. It gets boring in some parts, but you know, it's only 32 pages in. And I want to start reading Twisted, right? Twisted by Lori House Anderson, and I actually want to read her book Speak as well, but I haven't gotten to that, so I got this from the library. I really want to read this book, so once I finish those two, I'll, you know, pick up this one, and possibly one of her other books, I'm not sure. Um, so, that's my plan. I'm getting back into reading. Um, a few other updates. Oh, okay, well, I have to go to the library. I go to the library like every other day or every two days sometimes. Um, I am doing homeschooling or like online schooling. It's more online schooling. So I'm not like going to actual public school anymore. I'm doing online schooling and I actually really enjoy it. I like it. And it's kind of boring sometimes because like you're not around anybody. But, you know, I have friends at the church and um, my old school, so, you know, it's all, it's all good. I like it, and I am writing a, I don't know, short, like, book novella thing. I don't know, it's just like a short book, and it's actually going pretty far, and I'm, like, really, I don't know, I'm proud of it, I guess. I feel like I'm doing a fairly well job with it, so... Yes, and I'm really excited about that. So that's about it. Again, I am extremely sorry. I hope to see you in another video in a week or two. I hope it's not another month, but if it is, I'm sorry. So I will talk to you soon, and um, I'll probably have a book haul next because I'm actually going to the library today. They're having a book sale, two dollars to fill a bag. So I'll have a bag of books to show you in my next video. So, 
Yes, thank you. I'm so sorry, and I will see you later.